Some people can't afford expensive or performance model cars, and so therefore never bother thinking the price will be out of reach for them. But there are some cars out there that you can pick up for little money that look every bit as expensive as they might seem to everyone else and probably cost three times as much new. Check out our list of 10 cheap cars that will make you look rich. You might just be surprised. Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution Some cars are just born with a performance look, and the Mitsubishi Lancer was one of them. Starting with the year 2000 production model, the Lancer started to look like a serious performance machine. The 2005 and 06 models came with more performance styling, ground effects packages, and rear wing stabilizers. Some of the Evolution 9 cars came with Recaro racing style seats, and the turbocharged 2000cc inline four cylinder engine on all these cars put out 295 base horsepower. Some Japanese spec Evos can reach an output of 317 horsepower, and some versions in the UK market can be found with 440 horsepower. With an all-wheel drive powertrain, the base version of the cars can do 0 to 60 in 5 seconds and does a quarter mile in 13 seconds. That might not sound real impressive, but Lancers have all-wheel drive, which makes them excellent rally cars that can easily hold their own with the Subaru WRX and other rally cars. The Lancer Evo is also a favorite of martial arts legend Jackie Chan. It sounds like you would pay a lot of money for one of these cars, but the best thing is you can find one for an average price of just 15,000 US dollars for a 2005 or 2006 model year. Porsche 911 Porsche has been a status symbol for their owners since the beginning. Not only are these cars usually heavy on the performance side, they can cost quite a bit of money. Even used classic Porsches can fetch over $100,000 depending on the model and what condition they are in. What you probably don't know is that you can pick up one of these cars for around $15,000, such as a 1999-2000 Porsche Carrera base model. And just because it's cheap doesn't mean it's lacking any of the qualities of a Porsche automobile. The flat six-cylinder in this base car puts out almost 300 horsepower stock. But it's a Porsche, and that right there says everything. Drive one of these and everyone will think you are rich. BMW Z4 BMWs are also known as a performance and luxury car with a lot of sporty models offered by the car maker. The BMW Z4 is one of those cars and while it looks like you need a lot of money to own one of these cars, you might be surprised how little you can pick one up for. The market seems to be flooded with model years 2003 and up and you can get one for as low as 6,000 US dollars. The sleek and sporty little two-door roadster can have a four or six cylinder engine with different models putting out around 215 or more base horsepower. And you might find one turbocharged for a bit more money with the M model six cylinder putting out 338 base horsepower. Some of them are convertibles adding even more expensive style and looks. If you are looking for something that will make you look respectable or if you want to impress the opposite sex, then this might be the car for you. 2015 BMW 3 Series 320i Here is another BMW and is a very nice car that will make anyone driving the car appear that they have more money than they really do. This next generation BMW gives the impression that anyone driving it is wealthy, and the car also has great performance and style. The engines in the small luxury car included a turbo no matter what engine you had optioned on the car. The 320i doesn't pack a lot of power with only about 181 horsepower. But as a sort of a luxury sports sedan, the body style made it look expensive, and the comfort of the car and its styling kind of made up for its lack of performance power. It is still a fairly decent car for the money, and some 2000 models can be found for around $15,000. Dodge Challenger We're almost sure that everyone will agree that the Dodge Challenger retro muscle car looks really cool, and that it must be an expensive car but you might be surprised at how little you could own one for. The Dodge Challenger is a legendary muscle car that made its debut in the fall of 1969 as a 1970 model car. It's been back in production off and on since then, and in 2008, the third generation Challenger was unveiled, and even the lowest base model had a 3.5 liter V6 that put down 250 horsepower. But a 5.7 liter Hemi V8 was also available that produced 370 horsepower. And if that wasn't enough, the special model SRT-8 had a 6.1-liter Hemi V8 that produced a tire-burning 425 base horsepower. With all this cool stuff, anyone would think this car would cost a pretty penny. 
but you could own one of these cars from between $8,000 on average and even pick up an SRT8 for around $20,000, which is about the average going price. Chevrolet Camaro. Another retro car, the Chevy Camaro is a car that looks like it would cost a lot of money due to that amazing retro style that brings along some of the legendary muscle car charms. In 2010, Chevrolet rolled out the fifth generation car and it had everyone's attention. Suddenly it seemed like this was the cool new car to have and the styling of the two-door coupe with the giant sized rims and two-tone paint job with black stripes looked not only fast, but many were left thinking that the car was really expensive. Not only this, but it's a Camaro, and these cars have a reputation for being high-performance cars no matter the year. And if you've ever seen the Transformers movie, you will recognize this car as Bumblebee. That is, if you happen to see the popular yellow with black stripes model that can be found just about anywhere. You can pick up a nice Chevy Camaro with a V6 engine, which puts out a decent 312 horsepower on average for just $13,000. And you will look like a million bucks driving this thing. And if that's not enough power, there are plenty of V8 engine models for under $25,000 and you might even find a Super Sport. Dodge Viper The interesting thing about this car is that it first debuted back in 1991 and looked like it was a supercar that would cost at least $100,000. And while this car is a bit more money and isn't really that cheap of a car, it's still a whole lot of modern muscle that looks expensive to own. Not to mention that just being in a Dodge Viper says enough to anyone around you that is checking out the cool-looking body design with the super wide tires on the rear. You would think that this car might cost a fortune to own, right? You would be surprised to find out that for around $20,000 you could own one of these cars and everyone would notice you. And what a bargain this car is. And the RT10 having amazing performance and a V8 that produces 400 horsepower and 465 foot-pounds of torque. Regardless, it is likely you won't find anyone that would want to go for a ride in this bad boy. Maserati Gran Turismo If you really want to grab someone's attention and make them think you won some small lottery, then pick up a 2008 to 2010 Maserati Gran Turismo. The name of this car already screams expensive, and the look of this car will have people telling themselves that you must be doing really well to afford such a car. This car started out with a base price of over $100,000, but you can pick up one of these beautiful cars used for around $25,000 these days. That's a big time bargain for a car that costs over hundred grand off the showroom floor. The Ferrari derived 4.2 liter 405 horsepower V8 engine means that you could get anywhere fast and in high class style. Everyone will want to know what kind of car this is and how much it costs you. And they might even ask if they can get their photo taken with the car. Nissan GTR The Nissan GTR is a car that is synonymous with performance, and it is the successor to the legendary Nissan Skyline. The way this car looks with its quad exhaust pipe tips, the heavily styled body package including the wings and its sport tires, and its stylish leather interior, it would seem that you'd need a pocket full of cash to own one of these cars. The V6 twin-turbocharged engine in the Nissan GTR puts out a stated 480 horsepower. But many say that conservative number was only stated so that the insurance rates didn't drain the owner's pocketbook. Most say it's a 550 horsepower car. It had a base price of around $150,000, but you can own one of these amazing cars for around $40,000. Audi R8 if you have any idea who Iron Man is and have watched the movies, then you will recognize this car as one of the Tony Stark's main rides. The Audi R8 Quattro is a sports car that simply looks expensive. This mid-engine two-seater sports car got a lot of attention when it was released for the road in 2005 and was named after their Audi R8 race car, which was launched in 2006. The 10-cylinder in the R8 comes in two strengths. The standard version makes 540 horsepower and 398 foot-pounds of torque while the V10 Plus is good for 610 horses and 413 foot-pounds. And while the car costs new, anywhere from $165,000 to $200,000, you can pick up one of these cars for around $55,000 on average. We hope you enjoyed this list and want to know which one would you choose. Let us know in the comments below. If you like this video and you don't want to miss out when we release a new one, then click the subscribe link and you'll get notified the moment we have a new one for you. We appreciate you and want to thank you for watching.